Today we will be reviewing the Reaper Bones Goblin 4-pack. I bought two of them, so I have two of these guys, two of these guys, two of these guys, and two of these guys. So two Archer, two Spearmen, two Goblins with a sword and a spear, and two Goblins with swords. And so, well, I'll just get right into the review. They took the paint that I put on them really well. The sculpts are really nice, and it was really affordable. I think it was around $10 for a pack of four. So it was really good, because I bought the, yeah, I bought these two packs for $20. Oop, knocked one over there. And they took the paint really well with the really nice sculpts. So they actually go really well with the WizKids, uh, or, uh, yeah, WizKids Bugbears. And it's really, they, uh, they seem relatively within scale of one another so it's pretty good there they're in they seem in, they, they're well in scale with the other whiz kids miniatures so they work really well there and i really like the sculpts i really like the expression on this guy with the bandage covering his eye let's see if you can focus yeah i really like this guy this is probably one of my favorites all the ones that you see here with the whiz kids bases that i had extras of uh they're my favorites. I really like this guy. So that was the... I first showed you Speedman. This is the Archer. Focus, please. Uh, why is it not focusing? That's uh, good. Eh, look at that as best as you can, but... It's not focusing as well as it was beforehand. Alright, so there's that one. Nope, I dropped him. Here's the next one. Here in the back there. Whoa, I'm trembling. <laughs> there we go. And then, last but not least, the goblins with the sword. These look like goblin females. I may be mistaken, but that's what they look like to me. And so, overall, they're really nice. They took the paint that I put on them really well. I put no clear coat on this as of yet, because I don't have anything, any clear coats in the house currently. But they took the paint that I put on them really well. And they were just cheap Hobby, Hobby Lobby, hashtag not sponsored, Hobby Lobby acrylic paints. And they took them really well. I mixed the colors and they little and they worked really well. They work with the bugbears that I have. They just they're nice. They fit into the one inch grid of I th uh which dice mat is this? I don't know. Uh, Chessex. This is a Chessex dice mat. I forgot the dimensions of it though. So currently, but this is they fit well into the one inch grid and they work really well. I'm excited to use these in my next uh, session because funny story. I ordered these, and they came, they came in on Friday, which is when I usually have my D&D sessions, but they came in later in the evening, so I didn't get to use them. But I'm excited, and they were, they were my players, they were actually at a goblin encampment, so that kind of makes me mad. But yeah, this is, these are the Reaper Bones Goblin 4-pack, or 8 total. I bought two of them. And from now, from, well, peace out.